Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are gonna learn how to create a bold lip makeup look. If you guys are interested in watching or learning this look, please stay tuned. So I have already completed my foundation routine and I am gonna go in with a base. This is Soft Orc by MAC Cosmetics. I have been so in love with this palette uh, for the month of January. It is my Sigma Beauty Brilliant and Spellbinding palette. I am going in with the color Balmy, which is going to be my transition color. Using my cute little Sigma E55 brush, I am going to tap on the shade in ID2. This shade is just the perfect purpley silver color. I am absolutely in love with it. Next, I'm going to take the shade in Faye. And this is kind of just a dark, plummy, purpley color. It's really pretty. We're going to tap that right in the inner and outer corners of the eye to create a nice smoky effect. Without picking up any additional eyeshadow, we are just going to take our favorite blending brush and just softly blend those shadows until we create a nice seamless look. Because I want this eye to have more of a smoky effect, I am going to just tap on the color Fay on the outer corners of the eye and build on that color until I achieve that nice smoky look that I want. Always remember with any eyeshadow look, you want to take the time to blend your eyeshadows out to give them a really nice smooth transition. You'll see here that I'm blending my eyeshadows in an outward upward motion. This will help my eyes to appear more youthful and awake. So those of you that have watched my previous tutorials, you will know that I am a huge fan of Inglot's Gel Eyeliner. I absolutely love it. It's amazing. So I'm going to use their shade number 77 and we are going to create a dramatic wing. So now we're going to take that same gel liner and we're going to place it right on the bottom waterline. Now depending on your eye shape, this could actually make your eyes look a little bit smaller. So to prevent that, we're going to take our shade IG2 in the Sigma Beauty palette and we're just going to shade this color right by the lash line. And just for that wow factor and a little extra credit, we are going to take the color Healthy and tap it right in the inner corners of the eye. And I just like to touch up on any eyeshadows just to complete my look. Using brush 168 by MAC Cosmetics, I'm just going to dust off any excess shadow and my banana powder. So I just want to give a huge shout out to Thrive Cosmetics on creating some amazing lashes. I have worn these lashes probably about 10 times and they are still in great condition and they're easy to put on and super, super natural. I love them and I'm wearing the style in Robin. So after giving my face a little contour, I'm going in with Max Blush Baby to use as my blush shade and also going in with a little bit of bronzer. You guys know I love me some bronzer. So I'm using CoverGirl Queen's Collection in the color Brown Bronze. And can we just talk about this highlight for a second? Ugh, this Mary Luminizer is amazing. Look at that. The bomb has done it. Yes, honey. <laughs> so since we are using a liquid lipstick for today's makeup look, I wanna make sure that my lips are nice and exfoliated and hydrated. I'm gonna use my favorite lip scrub by Lush in Mint Juleps and it tastes amazing. And then I'm gonna use my EOS Lip Balm in Strawberry Sorbet. Yum E. So now to the good part. The reason why we are all here today. <laughs> this is Anastasia Beverly Hills new liquid lipstick in the color Potion. O-M-G. This color is amazing. Not only is this color just so rich and bold and luscious, uh, I just wanna eat it, but it also just goes on so smooth, it feels so creamy, and even when it dries, it still feels moisturizing. I am in love. 
Oh my God, I love it so much. I want to cry. <laughs> Because I like a nice, perfected lip, I am gonna go in with a sharpened lip pencil by MAC Cosmetics in the shade Night Moth. So if you guys are like me and like a really nice, defined lip, you don't have to just stop there. We can actually go in and take some concealer and just clean up the edges of the lip. I am using Pro Long Wear Concealer by MAC Cosmetics. And to complete this look, I'm gonna tame these brows with some Makeup Forever Brow Seal. And here is our finished look. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You guys are amazing and I love you and I'll see you next time. Bye.